What's up guys welcome to tech brunch do like and share the video subscribe to the channel and watch out for the data structure uh, beginner playlist so that if you are new to the data structure you can learn something from there so here we need to solve the problem where we are given a string and we need to convert it into lower case and uh, return the same string in the lower case and uh, basically they are they want us not to use any library function and we have to convert it into the lower case so the easiest way to do it is uh, to go through the ascii value of each of the character that we have <coughs> so if the character is an upper case character you need to convert it into lower case by adding something to it and that something will come from the ascii table let me quickly go to uh, ascii table from google i just uh, got it from some site so here if you see a the capital a starts at number 65 the decimal number is 65 and z it reaches at 90 and the small a it starts at 97 and the capital z it ends at 122 so if you see <coughs> the difference between the capital and the small letter is 32 basically you add 32 to 65 you get 97 you add 32 to 66 you get 98 so the difference between these are of 32 so if i get a capital letter here so if i add 32 to that character to the ascii value of that character i will get the lower case value so that is what we are going to implement here so what we can do is we can convert the current string into uh, into a uh, into character array basically and uh, then that character array can be further converted into string so we will say char <coughs> array which will be my result so this result array will be new char array of str dot length and uh, we will have a count which will be zero initially and uh, we'll keep on incrementing it for each of the character that is encountered now we will have a char c which will come from this string so str dot to char array we convert it into char array and uh, then we will see if this c is greater than equal to a and this c is less than equal to z so if it is between a to z in that particular case so <coughs> in that particular case uh, we have a capital letter coming in uh, means we have a capital letter in this string so if it is between these two so what we will do is we will when we create our result so result dot count so this array will be a char so it will be c plus 32 so will simply add 32 to this character so if it is a will add 32 to it it will become small a otherwise <coughs> otherwise the result will be result of the count this is equal to c whatever char we have if it is not between these two so it means that it is a lower case uh, it is lower case by default and will say count plus plus so that is how we have this character array built up and uh, since we have to return string so when we return we will say new string for this result and that's it so if i run the code <coughs> so that is how this hello got converted into this hello so we'll submit it So that's it so that's it for this video see you in the next one take care bye